Now to the growing popularity of artificial intelligence. Some are using the technology as a personal trainer to create customized workouts. ABC's Becky Worley tried out a couple of the options. Arms locked straight and tight. There you go. You want to get strong? Dig, dig, dig. Cornell Bass of GBC Coaching in Novato, California can get you there. Breathe, breathe. Don't hold your breath. Come down really slow. What's your goal? That's the first thing I'm going to ask you. Whether it's nutrition, whether it's just working out. Most people want a combination. Yeah, we can do 10. Oh my gosh. Right. You're pushing me. I love it. But if you don't have access to a personal trainer, could a new crop of artificial intelligence apps like Fitness AI and Zing Coach or even ChatGPT help you? I start with ChatGPT since it's free. The prompt here is key. Act as my personal trainer and create a 30 minute lower body workout to increase strength. I have a barbell, dumbbells and resistance band. I gotta print this. Warm up and then six different exercises. Here we go. One of the exercises, a Bulgarian split squat, is kind of technical. It's an exercise Cornell had me do, and I needed a lot of coaching. Okay, ChatGPT is obviously not gonna be able to correct my technique, but the price was right. Free. Now to the apps. Fitness AI costs $19.99 a month, and it creates workouts based on a questionnaire and data that you import from other fitness apps like Apple Health. What I like is you tell the app what equipment you have, so in my case, a medicine ball or a dumbbell, and then you tell it how much time you have for your workout, and it programs the whole thing. It shows you the proper technique, and you log your reps and weights. And then Fitness AI adjusts your future workouts, making them easier or harder. That's the AI part of the app. Finally, Zing Coach. The premium version costs $18.99 a month. It customizes your workouts by gathering data from other health apps, and it asks a series of questions and offers some cool AI features. Complete as many squats as you can in one minute. It determines if my squats are deep enough and my push-ups are to regulation by using the phone camera. Then it programs workouts with what looks like a real-life instructor who offers some AI encouragement. Excellent job. Both of these fitness apps track how much weight you lift and how many reps you can do, and then it makes the workouts progressively harder. These apps and ChatGPT are interesting ways to spice up your workouts and track your progress, but none of them seem to replace a personal trainer like Cornell. I'm gonna be so sore tomorrow.